आई एम डॉक्टर हिमांशु गुप्ता एंड आई एम डूइंग रेडियोलॉजी फ्रॉम मौलाना दत्त मेडिकल कॉलेज एज यू नो आई हैव मेड अ पेज परपस ऑन फेसबुक एंड यू कैन सर्च इट बाय द नेम परपस बाय हिमांशु गुप्ता वेर आई गिव टिप्स एंड सजेशन फॉर स्टूडेंट्स हु आर प्रिपेयरिंग फॉर नीट पी जी इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस योर टारगेट्स दैट यू विल बी सेटिंग फॉर द मंथ्स ऑफ ऑगस्ट सेप्टेम्बर एंड अक्टूबर your first target should be that you complete the first read of your subjects by the month of september you should be de- definitely complete with the first read by the end of september your second target besides doing your first read you will also start the revision of the subjects that you have done till the end of july you will be devoting at least 3 to 6 hours daily for revision all the subjects that you have done till the end of july maybe it can be 10 subjects that you complete by the end of september or 15 subjects but you will definitely start revision of all the subjects because if you delay your revision now to complete your first read what will happen is that when you do the revision of the subjects that you have done till july it will take a lot of time for you to cover these subjects in the month of october so i will suggest that you start your revision now thirdly you will start the previous year questions of aims and pgi <clears throat> if you are preparing for aims then you should target only aims question and if you are preparing for pgi then only pgi questions you cannot do aims and pgi questions together because it takes a lot of time what you will do is that from the first week of august you will try to complete at least two paper of aims daily in each week if you do so if you try to complete two papers of aims in each week you will be completed you will be done with the five year paper of aims by the end of september so as the september ends you will be complete with the previous year questions of aims and pga and you will be complete with the first revision of of your subjects and revision of few subjects now comes the month of october from the first october to the day of cbt exam you will target that you will read important points and topics of all the subjects till the 15th october you have to try to cover as much syllabus as possible before the cbt exam so when your cbt result comes you will uh, check the answers and you will analyze your mistakes you will analyze your weak subjects and from the 15th october to the 25th october you will mainly focus on your weak subjects and weak topics so by the end of 25th october you will be finished with the second read as well as you you will have <coughs> made your uh, you will have done your weak subjects and weak topics by the 25th october from 25th october to the aims exam you will again start your revision <coughs> from the anatomy and you will try to complete your revision before the aims exam and for the aims exam you will in 15 days you will basically focus on important topics that are more frequently asked in in exam and you will do mostly your notes okay friends Uh, thank you for watching this video and you can uh, uh, search my uh, page on facebook by the name purpose where you will get more updates and uh, tips and suggestions for the neat pg and aim exam thank you friends